Alright, Haseo Rocks is here doing another Let's Play on the side of uh, Golden Sun. It is pretty much a classic in any genre whatsoever. Everyone's heard of it, and yes, it is that. Alright. Oh. Normally, no time moves wouldn't work on that, but okay. And yes, it is the classic remake of the classic Pokemon game, Pokemon Red. It's Pokemon Fire Red. That's just a... Alright, this is just... This is just a tutorial of how to explain things. I'll, I'll pretty much explain it. And this will just give you a little story in case you have never played a Pokemon game before. Alright, this is Professor Oak. Hello there, glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets. Others use them for battling and or slave work. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. And he gets the ladies. But first, tell me a little about yourself. Uh, I, I like camels. Tell me, are you a boy or are you a girl? I'm a boy. Let's see, let's give me your name, what is it? Uh, it's gonna pretty much stay traditional in all my Let's Plays. If I can name the character, I will. Who will always be Haseo. Right, your name is Haseo. Yes, indeedy. And this is my grandson. He is a jerk. He is a douchebag. He's been your rival since you were both babies. Or what was his name in it now? Traditional anime sake. Was it Gary? That's right, I remember now. His name is Gary. You don't remember your own grandson's name. Marvelous. Haseo, your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon await. Let's go! Yeehaw! Alright, so we're here. Uh, first thing you want to do is definitely, definitely, 100% grab this potion out of your PC. It's pretty much a staple in any Pokemon game except for, I believe, uh, the newer versions because they don't have item storage, I believe. Because you have, like, a, an infinite pack. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're just going to go out to the grass. Gonna save time. Hey, wait, don't go out. Oh, I will. And you won't expect it. It's unsafe. Wild Pokemon live in tall grass. You need your own Pokemon to, for your own protection. I know. Here, come with me. Alright. Gramps, I'm fed up at waiting. I bet you you are. Gary, let me think. Oh, that's right. I told you to come. Just wait. Here, Haseo. There are three Pokemon here. Haha. -ha. These Pokemon are held inside these Pokeballs. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. But now, in my old age, I have only these three left. You can have one, so choose. Hey, Gramps, no fair. What about me? Be patient, Gary. You can have one, too. Alright, we have three Pokemon here. We have Bulbasaur. Good with special attacks and special defense, I believe. Um, we have Squirtle, which is mostly for defense and special defense. And then we have Charmander, which is going to be for speed and attack, I believe. I'm going to take Charmander, because uh, it's one of my favorites. You want to give a nickname to him? No, not yet. And then I'll take this one too, and he takes the Squirtle. He always choose the opposite uh, type than you to have the type advantage. We leave. Wait, Haseo, let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. Yeah, this is all one big tutorial, but it's pretty much required. It's pretty much the boring part of the LP. Rival Gary would like to battle. Rival Gary sent out Squirtle. Of course he did. Go, Charmander. Yay. Oh, for peace sake, so pushy as always. Haseo, you've never had a Pokemon battle before, have you? Pokemon battle when trainers pit their Pokemon against each other. A trainer that makes the other Pokemon faint by lowering their HP to zero wins. Rather than talk about it, we'll learn more from experience. Try battling and see for yourself. Well, I've battled many times in my life. I guess now, inflicting damage is the key to any battle, yeah. I guess right now I'm just going to explain this LP. Uh, it's pretty much, I'm making this LP for another, for a French channel, for a group thing. But, um, actually I may also uh, put this on my channel as well, so if you see it on my channel, don't be surprised. The video is going to be 15 minutes long. Uh, so it can fit on the other channel. Um, 
I'm not going to stick with a 6 Pokemon team. I'm probably going to have maybe like 12 because they're... I already have some Pokemon in mind, it's just that I won't be able to have them all in my team, which is kind of sad. So I'm going to try and switch them around as much as I can, so I'm probably thinking of having a uh, six Pokemon team. So uh, we'll see how that, or a 12 Pokemon team, we'll see how that goes. I already have some in mind. Uh, nicknames. As far as nicknames go, I will take suggestions for Pokemon nicknames and try and have a contest later about them. You definitely want to win this battle in the beginning because it's an easy level up. That's why I have the potion in case you are really low on HP and you're about to lose the battle. You have the potion. And we win, you know, we earn prize money, all that good stuff. Battle other trainers, you know, make Pokemon strong. I get it. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon battle and toughen it up. So, Gramps, see you later. Yeah, you will, you jerk. Alright, so we walk out. Uh, I'm just going to check my Pokemon real quick. Actually, I'm going to do my options. Fast, okay. Um, I'm gonna save. Warning, there's a different save file. If say now, I don't have another save file, but okay. Ah. I hate how they put the cursor on everything. Yes. Saving, don't save error. Please exchange it back. Oh. So evidently, I can't save, guys. This is kind of depressing. But, uh, look, look, I kind of always said one of the trainer's tip signs. Trainer tips. Press start to open the menu. Perfect. Marvelous. Alright, so we walk up here and we should get our first random encounter, hopefully. Or not. You can talk to this guy and he works at a Pokemart. You know, he, he'll give you a potion for free. Definitely worth it. I forgot to check if my Pokemon was all healed up. It is, perfectly. They healed it up. Perfect. Alright, we'll walk up here. And yes, we get our first random encounter and it is a Pidgey. Level 3. Uh, I'm not going to capture, I'm not going to catch a Pidgey in this LP. Um, I will for like the Pokedex sake, I guess. I'll catch a certain amount of Pokemon to get what I want. Like there are certain items that I want. But uh, Pidgey I will not be using on my Pokemon team because yes, everyone's like, oh it's a Pidgey, it's a beginning starter, it's a be beginning flying type. Yeah, it can be helpful, but I'd rather go with a uh, another flying type at my mind that I can get really early on. And um... Anyone who's played this game will probably know what kind of Pokemon I'm talking about. Uh, another Rattata, why not? Oh, a Rattata, new Pokemon. Again, I'm not going to capture this Rattata just because it's a normal type and it's pretty garbage, to be honest. Rattata and its ball form Raticate can be kind of annoying, but I still see them in single player play. Uh, we got a random critical hit, that means nothing. Charmander grew to level 7. And he learned Ember. Perfect. He learned a fire attack already. We are cooking now. Alright, so we walk up here, and that should do for uh, random encounters for right now. Yep, Viridian City. Uh, first major city. Uh, go to the Pokemon Center to heal up. Welcome to a Pokemon Center. Would you like to heal your Pokemon? Yeah, sure. Thank you for waiting. Restore your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. I bet you, you do. Alright, so we go over here, and we should see a Pokemart. Yep, this is our next objective. Hey, you came from Palatown. You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Can I get you to take it to him? And we received the Oak's parcel. We put it in the key out of his pocket. Alright, now we have to go deliver it to Professor Oak. Uh, we should have enough time to do that, and maybe catch a uh, Pokemon or I have two Pokemon in mind that I want to catch really in the early beginning, like in the next route. I actually want to catch two Pokemon. Uh, one of them is really rare to get though, so you never know if I'll actually catch it or not. Jump down. Dude. Oh, random encounter, of course. They really want to try and make me go past this 15 minute limit. 15 minute limit here. Um, it's going to run away. Not worth the experience to fight it right now. Um, da 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 The music in this game is so much better remaked, to be honest. Oh, well, say, how's my old Pokemon? It seems to be growing more attached to you. You must be talented as Pokemon Chair. What's that? You have something for me? And we deliver Oak's parcel. Yay, we did our first major thing. Ah, it's the custom Pokeball. I had it on order. Thank you. Gramps. Oh boy, the jerk. I almost forgot, why'd you call me? Oh. Alright, I have a request for you two. And 
the desk, this is my invention, the Pokedex. There are micro records data of Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Hoseo and Gary, take these with you. And we will receive the Pokedex from Professor Oak. You can't get detailed data on Pokemon just by seeing them. You gotta catch them in order to get complete data. So here's some tools for catching wild Pokemon. Receive wild five Pokeballs. That's why. Yay. And now we can catch Pokemon. I know. I know how to catch. I'll explain how to catch Pokemon later. Ah, uh, cutscenes. I don't care. I don't want a town map. I'll, I, I don't need one. I know where I'm going, guys. Alright, so we go over here. And I guess for completion's sake, we should go get the town map just in case. We're running at around like 10 and a half minutes here. So, um. Yeah, rather lazy of my know. We receive a town map from Daisy, because Daisy's awesome. We love Daisy. Alright, so, um. Walk on out. Do, 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 do. Yeah, the beginning of this game gets really slow, but it's still a good game. Like, later on, it gets intense sometimes with what you can do. Remember one time I had a 20 minute battle against uh, one of the Elite Four members. <sighs> Pretty classic battle in my Pokemon lifetime. And another Pidgey. Yeah, all of this field, all they are is Pidgey and Rattatas to get you ready. But, um,. I'm gonna see if I can try and not get any random battles so I don't have to. Grr. I got like four minutes here to try and catch a Pokemon that I want to show you guys. I'm gonna run. Alright. Um, I don't know if I can actually catch these Pokemon right now because I think I have to go through a, a uh, optional battle. I'm not sure, but I'm gonna find out real quick. Um. Alright, no, good. Phew. We can actually go into this grass, and there are several Pokemon in this grass, so you may want to think about catching. If I don't catch them during this episode, I'll just catch them off screen. Here we have a Rattata, which is kind of useless. Uh, we're going to run. And. Do, 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 do. Yeah, the, the next three minutes is probably just going to be me trying to catch Pokemon. Ah, here's one of them Mankey, fighting type. Uh, Mankey is actually a really good Pokemon to have early on, because, uh, I'm just gonna say it right then and there, he's a really good Pokemon to have early on, uh, for me. He's kind of an underrated Pokemon, to be honest. Oh, not a, not a Pokemon. I need a Pokeball. Like, uh, Mankey's a really underrated Pokemon, um, actually when you evolve, when Mankey evolves into Primate, he becomes one of the fastest fight fighting Pokemon in the game. Like, he will be a beast. And so, we have Mankey on our team now. That, he's gonna be one of my basics. Um, no, we're not gonna give him a name. Uh, two minutes to try and capture one Pokemon that I, uh... Uh, nope, not a Mankey. Oh, this is gonna be difficult. Like I said, if I don't get him in this, uh, episode, I will just... I will just... Do it off screen and show you later. Actually, I actually have to think about ending the video right now if I don't. Oh, never mind, here he is. Spiro, flying type. I believe it's flying normal if I'm not mistaken. A uh, very crucial Pokemon for me to have right now because it knows Peck automatically. Peck is now a flying move in this game and it'll help us really early on with some shit. So, um, use a Pokeball. You should catch a Spearow right here and now, which would be really good. Uh, basically, I just now have three of my six team, three of my six Pokemon for my team right now. Like literally, these are these Pokemon I'm gonna stick with. All right, so we leave, and I think I'm gonna cut it off right here. So in the next part, we're actually gonna probably actually do some stuff, probably adventure on, uh, probably get to our first gym or our first. Uh, First gym battle, first gym leader. Oh, we have a, we have a, we have a dungeon to go through actually. So um, I don't know yet. We'll see where that takes us. All right. So until then, this has been Hasera Rock is saying, uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.